All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the Angel Next Door Spoils Me Rotten episode three. Um, I really enjoyed the last episode between obviously Sheena and Fujimiya. Um, it was very sweet. I love the ending to where obviously because of the things he's she's been doing for him, and um, he obviously wanted to get a gifts to thank her. Um, I like the obviously I think someone pointed this out as well that there's no kind of intent behind these gifts. Obviously, he's not trying to woo her or anything like that. These are just general gifts. For someone who's obviously being just such a big help in his life at the moment, which I really enjoy. Um, yeah, I'm loving the anime so far, so I'm hoping to continue to see this wholesomeness carry on. And maybe it develop into something more, hopefully. Uh, we will see soon. But yeah. Anyway guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Who the hell is this? Who are you? Oh, is this mom? Yeah? It's like an older sister, bro. Holy shit. <laughs> the way he's acting with her. Why is he being like this with his mom? Is she like not nice to him or something usually? Yeah, we own this place. <laughs> oh, is Sheena going to be here? I mean, to be fair, up until Sheena started showing up, his his life was not as great. Yeah, she's hiding in his bedroom. Oh my god. This is going to be so sus. Oh, she knows. She's onto it. <laughs> oh, she's serious now. Yeah, she knows. She's going in anyway? Oh no. Oh my god, she fall asleep? Yeah? Like a literal angel? Okay. <laughs> oh, this mom. That's kind of true here. I ain't gonna lie, bro. You're catching feelings. That's vaguely kind of true as all as well, yeah. I mean, she at least trusts you. Oh, I hope she's not actually awake here on that. Oh no, now she's awake. Well, that's embarrassing. <laughs> well, you fell asleep up against the bed. Why were you not on the actual bed? I mean, I guess that would look worse. <laughs> Actually called her mum. Oh god. I can't believe she's just outright saying you're his girlfriend, right? Right? Lol. Bro, she's like tying them together right now. She's trying to fucking make this shit happen. Manifesting it. Are you being the third wheel? I don't know. You might be the wheel that's holding this car together. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Just give up. This is the encounter of a lifetime. Kind of true. <laughs> Definitely is. This mom's getting too much in their business, but I also feel like she's making this happen right now. He hasn't been with many women except me. Could you have worded that better? She keeps saying girlfriend. This mom might be the MVP, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, talks a lot. Yeah, she does. Oh, this must be the complete opposite for her. Her parents must not be in her life like this. Yeah, your parents don't even call you by your first name. Jesus. I mean, it, at this point, you are basically close friends. That's so sweet. Like, every episode unlocks a new stage in anime that would normally take a whole season to do. 
I always says when you don't want anything to do with me. Aww. That's so sweet. I'm sick of getting up, up to the door, so just let yourself in. That's really cute. <laughs> These don't sound like bad things, you know. I'm an A number 21. Ain't not bad. And she's number one. Jeez. Definitely programmed differently, bro. Like they like she's just naturally gifted or something. She just works hard at everything she does. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, but this is the first time you've taken first place since you've been friends, right? That's a really sweet gesture. He did it so, like, nonchalantly as well. Is she going to feed him? You want some? Ah, Ah, so many fucking cute moments in this episode. Another stage in anime that takes about a whole season to do. Indirect kissing right here. That's some, that's some aggressive cuteness, bro. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. It's like, you just did this to me. Now I'll see how it feels. <laughs> you are indeed, bro. The angel next door truly do be spoiling your run. <laughs> A bottle of barbecue sauce. This man cannot cook. <laughs> well, hmm. It's probably edible. It's supposed to be scrambled eggs. I mean, it's supposed to be an omelette. You didn't add salt and pepper? Jesus Christ, dude. When the hell did you make that? That looks so freaking good, man. Oh, no, bro, don't learn to cook. <laughs> I mean, in the kitchen, bro, you basically are. When is Sheena going to be introduced to the group, I wonder? I mean, they know her, but, like, at home. Oh, he's admitting to that, then. <laughs> this friend group's so funny. <laughs> what a good friend. Oh, he's doing it nicely, though. Yeah, this is too much. Can y'all go do that somewhere else? You can come to me after your Christmas party? Cute. Yeah, you're used to it. Doesn't mean you don't feel alone. Ah, that's that's relationship as hell. It's set in stone, bro. Oh, you want to play Switch? Oh, that'd be cute. She's a keeper, bro. You need to put a ring on her. Yeah, she's just sitting in your lap. Can y'all get a room? Please, <laughs> get out of my house. Yeah, just a group of you? Jesus. What do you think was going to happen? Well. Well. Oh, what if she's looking out on the balcony as well? 
Oh, she is. Oh, no. Well, that's that then. That's so funny. Is the episode going to end? I don't believe it. What a cliffhanger. Right, so that was episode three of The Angel Spoils, Next Door Spoils Me Rotten. Um, that was a very good episode. So many cute moments. I love the mom. She's very loud and proud and butting into business. But shit, she's making, she's making shit happen. Calling each other by first names, feeding each other, spending Christmas Day together. Admitting that even if I start to get better at cooking, I still want to eat your cooking. So much happened in this episode. I'm freaking here for it. Um, but yeah, this is... Uh, quite the situation now now that the friends are going to find out who is living next to him who the person is that's been cooking for him and uh yeah maybe they'll make it happen as well they'll they'll ship it just as much as the mum is um but yeah overall very good episode definitely looking forward to the next anyway guys i want to thank you guys so much for watching have a nice rest of your day and peace out <laughs>